I was kind of shocked, but like honored, because these are great players. They're in college, most of them, and a lot of them are, have been played in the Olympics, so I was excited and ready to test myself. I was very excited. Another competition. Competition's good. The 2013 Futures 50 Classic was a chance for many athletes to hone their skills alongside the best. That was no different for Laguna Beach residents Mackenzie and Aria Fisher, who have been quickly climbing the water polo ranks. Success runs in the family as Dad Eric played for Team USA at the 1992 Olympic Games and was a champion in college at Stanford. Before his girls ever played water polo, Eric wanted to make sure they were well-rounded athletes. He actually wouldn't let me play water polo until I was a good swimmer. When they were young, I wanted them to do a lot of different sports and not just focus on something really early. Let them kind of find the sport that, attracted, uh, that was attractive to them. So far, so good for the sisters, who picked up gold this summer with Team USA, Mackenzie at the Junior World Championships, and Aria at the Youth Pan American Games in Argentina. Another step in the growth of these water polo players. This experience is priceless uh, for both Mackenzie and Aria and a lot of the other high school girls and younger girls here because they get to play against these very talented, very skillful, smart, strong players. And you learn more in one of these games than you can learn in a whole season uh, at a lower level. It just helps me develop different skills that I wouldn't get if I was just playing in high school and club. There's all these great leaders on this team and they're like always helping me and like if I'm confused, they'll help me, so hopefully I can like bring that leadership back to my club team or high school team. And just the, the nerve and, the, and the, um, the attitude you have to have going against these older, skillful players. I like being the young one. I like surprising people and showing them what I can do. They're, they're both great, intense competitors, and you know that's something that in our sport is, is absolutely required to, to be at the highest level. When, when the daughters compete, they definitely go after it. Sometimes it's a little too personal, but uh, I think that's kind of normal for siblings. Playing it this afternoon and I'm gonna win. We're both competitive, so I wanna win, she wants to win, and hopefully I win. <laughs>